had been a few weeks since the wharf officially opened. All the snow had melted and Sir Handel and Peter Sam were sent there to meet up with 9705 and Ryan. Mr. Percival was there. Today is Scarlowy's birthday. He is turning 94 this year. We will have a surprise party for him at Croven's Gate. I already told Rusty to keep Scarlowy busy and away from Croven's Gate while we set it up. I need you two to wait here with 9705 and Ryan for his surprise visitor. Can I trust you all to do it right? Yes you can. All will be fine here. Okay. I'm counting on you. Then he left. The four engines were wondering who the surprise visitor was going to be. I think that it's an engine. Perhaps even a really famous one. Don't be silly. It's obviously a person. Maybe even the queen. If it's a person it has to be Wilbur Tawdry. He's the one who writes stories about us after all. Well I'm not going to think it's anyone just to not be disappointed if I'm wrong. Then the four saw a huge tramp steamer arrive into port. They were curious so they got near it for a closer inspection. Being loaded off of the ship was a narrow gauge engine that looked just like Scarlowy. Sir Handel decided to make a joke. Did someone leave Scarlowy's twin at the wharf? How did you know? Wait what? I am Scarlowy's twin. I'm visiting him on his birthday. Well I was just making a joke. So you're the surprise visitor. I guess I was right. Anyway, what's your name? Talon. Today's my birthday too. I work on a little railway in Wales with many other engines. Some that even look like you two engines. So what do we do? We were told to begin setting up a party at Croven's Gate. So we might as well start to go there. Rusty probably has Scarlowy at the other side of the railway by now. Let's go Scarlowy. You have orders to go to the slate mines. But it's my birthday. I never work on my birthday. Wait. Did I say work? I meant I still never got that Scarlowy railway tour all new engines get. But you've been here almost six months. Well we better do it again just to be safe. You can never be too safe I always say. Just as Rusty and Scarlowy left, the six engines made it to the sheds. Good thing Rusty got Scarlowy to take him on one of his tours. Those things take forever. We have about five hours to get this place decorated and everyone in their spots. Is this the party? Neil? What are you doing back on Soder? I heard about Scarlowy's party and decided I might as well visit. Also that I was brought here to help teach 9705 and Ryan about wharf duties for a few days. It didn't take long for the party to be set up and all the engines tending the party got into the right spots. How long will I have to sit here for? Not too long Sir Handel. How long does it take to give a tour of this tiny railway? This building is the Glenock School. This building is the Glenock Gas Station. This building is the Glenock Grocery Store. This building is a house. This building is also a house. Well he was known to go into greater detail about absolutely nothing. Wait. I think I see him over there. I can't believe the tour is over already that was fun. Yeah it was. Wait. What was that? In front of Scarlowy was a surprise party with all of his friends attending. I should have known. Is that Talon sitting over there? Talon and Scarlowy did some catching up and then they introduced him to Rusty and soon all the engines talked like old friends. The next morning was upsetting when Talon had to return back home in Wales. There was a celebration and everything. Just before Talon got on the boat Scarlowy told everyone to visit him and he wished Talon dry rails and good running from Scarlowy. His little old twin.